Hey guys, it's your girl Carrie, and today I want to share with you how I decorated my foyer for fall. And without further ado, I'm going to turn the camera around so we can get started. Here is an overview of the uh, my front foyer uh, entryway, the table, the buffet in the foyer, and as you know, um, previously I had a boxwood wreath there. I took the boxwood wreath down and put up this uh, nicely decorated grapevine wreath and I decorated with those elements that I shared in my fall um, haul video. And what I did was add a nice little bow there to the top in that uh, you know light blue robin's egg blue type color. I think the color of this ribbon is called farmhouse blue. And then I added in all of the blue little picks that I shared with you. And the large corn husk um, pick, I attached that to the grapevine wreath and I removed those uh, orange pumpkins and replaced them with white pumpkins. And then down on the bottom, I do think this is a bit much back here. I took those berries and just kind of stuck them back there with some flowers. But Essentially, I was just really trying to get all of that decor that was on my table off so that I could hurry up and do my impromptu dinner. And I'm going to pretty much scatter this around the rest of my home once I completely decorate the house. But this is what I came up with in, you know, less than an hour's time before I had guests come over. Then I took a couple of uh, my candlesticks that have already been here. And this is another way just to update your existing decor in your home for you know a specific season without having to go out and buy a bunch of seasonal items i just took my regular candlesticks that are normally always here next to the light and i just put a couple of those wreaths those leave candle wreaths around them and that's the overall look and what i did was cut a couple of those berries off and try to incorporate some of that blue bring some of that blue down here i don't have enough of berries to take away from our wreath so i'm going to swing back by joanne's fabric pick up another berry pick and continue to weave that blue into those leaves down there now this vessel here i usually um, keep some sort of arrangement or put some pine cones or whatever the season is i usually um, add some sort of greenery or nature in there but for the past several months we've been using it as a catch-all tray when we come into the house i drop my sunglasses in there we drop our car keys in there um what is this this is a car air freshener and things like that and it's actually been working out pretty well for us so i think maybe i'll you know decorate it for the holidays if someone's coming over or something like that, if I'm planning a party. But for our everyday use, I really, really like this vessel now as a catch-all tray. And then over here, we have just the standard lantern that's always there. I just updated it with some fall items. I put that little squirrel in the, um, you know, in the lantern. And then I took another one of those candle uh, wreaths, leave wreaths stuck that in there and some of the small pine cones and I needed to bring some of that blue over into our lantern so I took some of the sprigs that are like this and just stood them up behind the squirrel so that you can see so that everything kind of you know meshes together this setup right here is a little bit different for me it kind of reminds me of like one of those southern living magazines Reagan said it looks like a scarecrow <laughs> to her and she's not really feeling it. Let me know, even though if this may not be your style, you might be a glam person, you might be, you know, modern, um, but let me know in the comments below, is this something that you could appreciate uh, or is something that you're just like, nah, Carrie, you missed the mark, don't ever do this again. But um, it won't hurt my feelings. I am a very creative person. I like to express myself through my work and I like to do different things all the time. Please be sure to check out my fall tablescape video where I share tips and tricks on how to pull together an impromptu dinner party. So guys, I hope you enjoyed my fall foyer and until next time, I'm going to keep calm and carry on. Bye guys.